I'm not gonna lie, you know, I've been sitting here for the past like 10 minutes thinking of a funny way to start this video. I have had so many weird takes, but yeah, I'm gonna just start it like this because uh, <laughs> I don't know. Anyway, uh, as y'all can probably tell, I did buy some new lights. You guys should be able to see this now. Okay, guys, so me being the idiot I am, I just recorded that full intro and I had a song on Spotify playing in the background, so I can't use any of that anymore. So. <laughs> Yeah, Travis Scott just sold me. Not gonna lie, I really don't feel like recording this, but I'm gonna do it anyway, cause I have nothing else to do right now. That being said though, like I just said, as I'm sure y'all have noticed, I did actually buy some new lights. Might be a little bit too bright right now, but you guys should be able to see that this is visibly an improvement over what I had before. Y'all have been commenting again and again, Chris, setup looks fine, just get some new lights, and yeah, they should look pretty good now. I'm not even gonna lie to you guys, not have actual lights added to my setup, I'm starting to begin to feel like an actual YouTuber. Let me know if y'all feel like the content is actually changing or if it's just in my head i'm not gonna actually show you guys the lights because i'm pretty sure they would blind like half of y'all watching right now but i think that this is an improvement and if you guys have any more suggestions i'll gladly take them that being said though for today's video which i already recorded the intro for and i'm not recording we're gonna be playing a new roblox bleach game that should have already released and to be honest i'm not exactly sure why it didn't this is a game called project mugetsu and this game was supposed to drop two days ago i actually already recorded a video on this game in that video i literally said the game would be dropping between the 22nd and the 28th because that's what the owner said and as y'all can see the game is not out now if you look at the game's discord they have actually said that the game is going to be dropping between or actually on april 8th and they gave us a whole countdown and everything i really hope they actually are faithful to this one and to be fair there was no countdown before so maybe this one's legit but today's video though they actually added in some new shikai or bankai i'm not sure probably shikai because bleach games just don't like to release with bankai now i'm not sure why but it's just become a trend lately like i said though let me know what y'all think about the new lighting setup i think this does look 10 times better than it did before and if y'all agree or disagree, let me know why or why not down below. But uh, yeah, I'm gonna end the intro there. If you're new to the channel, I'd appreciate it if you hit that sub button. Let's get straight into the video. Yo, Project Mugetsu. Uh, real quick, let me just say for this video, I'm trying out the box face cam instead of using a circle. So you have to comment down below which one you prefer. I'm honestly not too sure. Both look decent to me, but yeah, a lot of y'all were saying to do a, a box or a rectangle instead of a circle. So if y'all prefer this, let me know. Anyway, though, um, let me just say this is not going to be a gameplay video. Truly, I'm not gonna sit here and grind a bunch of NPCs. I don't think y'all really want to watch that anyway, and I don't feel like doing it. So this is just gonna be like a she guy showcase for all the she guy in the game. That being said, though, let me see if I can go ahead and activated i think the command was roar zangetsu no ignition bar must be full what is that i apologize y'all if this video isn't like a great representation of what this game is because truthfully i really don't know much about project mugetsu like i don't even know what the ignition bar is that must be like a unique mechanic or something like that so okay there we go let's try that one more time i should have it now all right plays number one too don't feel cutscene. I don't really like the fact that it transformed my blade before the cutscene finished, but whatever. Alright, we're gonna go to Soul Society and finish this video there. If I can can I open it? Alright, y'all, we in the Soul Society now. As you guys can see, there is no watermark here. Thank God. But um, let's try this one more time. It's been like 10 minutes. I'm pretty sure that I figured out how to do this. So we're gonna try this one more time. Yep, I got it. Okay, so this should be the last time I have to actually play this cutscene out. I was really confused, but I think I got it all down now. So there's obviously an ignition bar. I guess that's just the system of how they make it so that you can't spam your Bankai. But anyway, this is on Getsu. We have four moves. The first one is Engetsu's on. Just a clean little slash. Nothing too crazy about that. The second move we have here is Getsuga Burst. Ooh, okay, stabs the ground. Effects eh, are decent. Nothing too crazy about that one. Third move we have here is Tenbu Renjin. All right, just a few little slashes. And the final move we have is Getsuga Tensho, obviously. Oh, oh, okay, I guess that's not finished. All right, on to the next one. All right, y'all, the next guy we have here is Senbon Zakura. So I think it's Roar for all of them. So Roar, Sen, I can't type. Roar, Sen, oh crap, did I spell it wrong? Ignition bar. Yo, this ignition bar is annoying. Oh my god. Alright, so they actually added in bosses, which is kind of cool. As y'all can see, we have Gin here, and he drops a, a handgun. Not really sure why Gin would drop a handgun, but hey, I mean, he does that, so that's cool, I guess. But anyway, though, second she guy we have here is Senbon Zakura. I'm pretty sure the command is just Roar Senbon Zakura. So, yep, there we go. Alright. Cutscene is dope. 
That's pretty cool. And it literally just makes our sword pink. Okay. I mean, it's accurate to the anime, so I can't get mad at that. So, first move we have here is Senbon Zakura. This is the Z move. Alright, just like a little wave of flower petals. Dope, dope. Next move we have here is Vibrance Bloom. This dude might be no party, not sure why. Okay. I mean, oh. And they blow up. Alright, that's dope. See what we have here is Scattering Spiral. Let's see this. Oh, we become the flower petals. Okay. And we are up to. Alright, that's dope. And the final move, Blossoming Petals. This is the V move. Looks like this. Oh. Oh, okay. Alright. I'm assuming this has like a really good AoE hit effect or something like that. But seeing as there's no NPCs here, I can't see that. And that lasts for a decent amount of time. So I guess that's not a terrible move. Alright, next Shiga we have here is, I believe, Hyorin Maru. She got me Hyorin Maru. All right, but so if I say Roar Hyorin Maru, I did not type that right. Okay, we gonna try that one more time. Okay, I think it's Roar Hyorin Maru. Yep, there we go. Okay. Um, so this is Ice. Obviously, this is Toshiro's She guy. Let's see this. First, what we have here is Ice Spikes. I don't know why it sounds like Ice Spice. Oh, that has some range on it. Okay, did not expect that to go that far. So this is definitely going to be pretty toxic. Next move we have here is Ice Traps. All right, this looks like absolute garbage. I do not see this move being useful whatsoever. Because obviously I'm assuming an NPC or like a player. Oh, we have to press X again. Okay, I mean, that's not bad then. Because we can actually control when it explodes. So that doesn't seem too, too bad. See what we have here is Ice Clone. Must be stunned. Oh, okay. So it's like an evasive, so I'm getting hit. I can use Ice Clone to get out of the combo. All right. Let's see if I can find an NPC in Soul Society to hit me real quick. Uh, any bosses literally anywhere to hit me? I did see that Gin boss before, so I'm assuming if I look around, I can find that. But not really seeing him. Uh, I, I don't want my Sheikai to run out before I can actually finish showcasing the moves. So real quick, this is the V ability, Ice Eruption. And that does not work. Okay, cool. All right, whatever. I guess I'm not going to be able to showcase the third move. Let's move on to the next one, which I believe is Ryujin Jaka. All right, so I think the command for this one should be Roar Ryujin Jaka. Yep. So this is obviously Yamamoto's and probably the cleanest effect so far with the flames. Nothing too, too crazy like usual, but I mean, it doesn't look bad. So first move we have here is Taimatsu. All right, like a little wave of flames. It's actually pretty fast too. I wonder if that's blockable. Next move we have here is Hito Sume Nadegiri. Okay. Does this not work? Or do I need Ryatsu? That might be it. I don't know. Maybe the move from before didn't work because I didn't have Ryatsu, but let's see this now. No, it's still not working. Okay, so I guess I don't even know why Fresh has me in here recording. Like half this stuff doesn't even seem to be working, but anyway, and it's Suji Goku. This is the C move. Ooh, okay. I'm actually messing with the fire sheet guy, aside from the X move just not working. Unless maybe it does work and it's like an evasive. I'm not sure. Call your Zonpok Toe. What? Is it not out? All right, my she guy just got deactivated for some reason. Let's activate this again. Roar Region Jaka. And the X move just doesn't work. That's so weird. But the final move, the V ability looks like this. Region Jaka. Yo, why does that not work? Fresh, how are you going to have me here recording these she guy and they're not even working? Nah, that's crazy. All right. I think we have like I think we have like one left, so let's just do that real quick. All right, so this is the last one. This is Gin Shikai, so this is probably gonna be pretty cool. So Roar Kamishini. Oh, okay, just did not work. Let's try resetting. Hold up. All right, bruh. Roar Kamishini, please work. There we go. Okay, and it changes our Shikai to like a little knife. That's actually pretty cool. Just like Gin. So do our M1 change? No. Oh my God, such a missed opportunity to give us like extended M1s. That would've been really cool. But first one we have here, hoping all these work, is Buto Renjin. Okay, all right, I messed with Gin. Just a couple little stabs. X ability we have is Zen Bujin. All right, like a little circular slash. That's dope. C ability is Shun So Geki. All right, I'm messed with Gint, and the final move is shoot him dead. So, that actually does not have nearly as much range as I thought it would. I figured it'd like go across the entire map. Not across the entire map, but much farther than that went. All right, so that's basically every single Sheikai in the game. Um, I'm a little bit confused as to why some of the abilities don't work, but I guess if you guys do want to see the full showcase, they did actually post some on the channel. I want to see if I can actually find a boss NPC to fight, and I'll probably end the video on that. But yeah, this has been Project Mugetsu, guys. The game is supposedly going to be releasing in two weeks on April 8th. I am not sure because, like I said in the intro, Fresh did say the game was going to be dropping before, and uh, yeah, it's still not out.
so <laughs> I don't know, but yeah, I'm in this part there. See, all right, y'all. So it's like there's a quest here to fight Gin, the captain boss. So hopefully, we can actually do this. Hey, you, you look strong. Can you be that guy over there for me? You look rewarded, or pff, you'll be rewarded. I can't read good looks. Um, Gin is supposed to be here, right? Oh. Did he just spawn in? Yep, he did. Okay. So I'll attempt to fight him. Um, I'm obviously pretty trash, but I guess we'll go ahead and use Gin's actual Shikai to fight him. So Roar, Kamishini. This is like one of the few that actually seem to be fully completed. I'm not really sure why Fresh would have me in here recording when like not everything seems done yet, but hey, whatever. This is his game, not mine. So the ability we have here is boot. Wait, why am I? I already showcased this. Anyway, let's see what this combat's looking like. All right, little air combat. Not sure what my animations get stunned like that, but I'm getting some Project Slayer. Oh, oh, he, oh, he popped this she guy. All right, dude, just Universal pushed me. Hold this. Oh my god, I I can't fight back. I need an evasive. I don't have an. Oh, wait, I think I do. Flash escape. We're gonna try that in a second. But all right, so flash escape isn't evasive. That's good. So far, the combat doesn't seem like anything too too crazy. It's looking like a a bleach version of Project Slayers, which. I think Fresh actually did work on Project Slayers, so I'm not really too surprised there. But yeah, again, is piecing me up. I'm not gonna lie, yo. I don't think I'll be able to actually beat this boss. He has 2,000 HP. I'm not even sure if this is somebody I can like beat by myself. And yeah, he's he's about to kill me. I'm getting absolutely voted right now. Also, I have no Rayatsu. I'm oh my god, and that's a guard break. Can't block that. Okay, maybe my stats are just too low. I'm I'm not sure about that. But for some reason, my Shikai has just disappeared. It's it's not on my hands anymore, but yeah, again, it's just, uh, he's just folding me. I'm not going to lie. There's not really too much I can, I can do, I guess. <laughs> he just kind of dropped me off right now. And we're dead. Okay. All right, I'm not going to lie. I'm going to call that video there. This has been Project Mugetsu. So far, I have to say, I'm not exactly sure if I'm going to be playing this game because from what I can see so far, this literally seems like Project Slayers, but Bleach and... Y'all don't really see me playing Project Slayers right now, not because it's a bad game, but I'm just not a fan of the grind as much. But when the game does drop an update, I'll be back on that. But yeah, this has been Project Mugetsu. Um, combat doesn't seem like anything too, too crazy. Like I said, I'm not sure if I'll be playing, but y'all are interested? This has been a quick little Shikai showcase. I'm sorry if I couldn't showcase everything. I did try. Like I said, let me know. Like, like I said, let me know what. Like I said, let me know what y'all prefer between the circular face cam and the rectangle. And uh, yeah, hope you enjoyed today's video. I'll see you guys next one. later.